I walked into Clicks the other day and I saw that they have this line of My Earth by Clicks. And um, among other things that they're selling there is reusable cloth nappies. And obviously I had to go ahead and try them out and see what's up with that. Are they the usual ones that we know or are they different? I had a bestie, a few, I think probably about five people messaged me on Instagram asking me if I have seen the cloth nappies that Clicks makes, what I think about them, have I used them and all of that fun stuff. So I went into Clicks recently and I bought three whole boxes, which are right here with me. I did review already. So I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys my quick thoughts, my first impressions, all of that fun stuff on these products so let's dive right into this video because if i'm the ocean you're the rain we only need each other baby you know we're the same I am a mom who uses cloth nappies. I use cloth nappies on all three of my children. With K-Bear, I did do a little bit of a 50-50 situation where it's disposables and cloth nappies. With Peanut and Nolly Nose, I was like 100% cloth nappies, especially here at home, because schools are not very into that cloth nappy movement yet. I think it's only because they haven't figured out how they work, where they're gonna store them, which technically speaking, it's the same as disposable nappies, except you just let the baby go back with the nappy. I do hope that with time, it will change and they will start welcoming more cloth nappies. But anyway, another story for another day i have been using cloth nappies with my kids i love them they have saved us so much money it's not even funny but today let's chat about my earth cloth nappies first thing i noticed is that they sell their products separately so you get a cloth nappy cover insets and then you get the liners separate i like the regular cloth nappies that you buy from the brand we know the brands we've used which i'm not going to name drop because this is not about that you get a cover and insets as like one purchase you would get that for about 180 and then you're basically good to go this one you kind of have to buy three separate things so that's the first thing that it kind of stood out to me and i was like whoa okay that's new the second thing i noticed they have cotton insets and you get five of them inside the box which i think again is pretty cool in the actual reusable nappy cover so you get three i'm gonna go ahead and just quickly say some of the things that they say here on their boxes so that you guys get a good feel of what it is i'm about to talk about eco-friendly it's reusable nappies and it's suitable from newborn to 36 months old it is chlorine free washable 100 percent recyclable packaging which is the box it says here poppers allow you to adjust nappy to keep up with growing baby that's the thing i love about cloth nappies you don't have to keep going back as the baby is growing up you basically just adjust them and then bobs your uncle use with insects and liners and then comma sold separately and then it gives you sort of like three reasons here's why it's good to use these nappies it says reusable and machine washable and pro washing machine i'm sure you know that by now it's innovative popper system allows for size adjustment as baby grows free from chlorine lotion and fragrances okay that's basically all of the blah 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 that they have on both their boxes this essentially is what the nappy looks like I have popped it here so let me just go ahead and open it that's what the nappy looks like it's nice and fleecy in there and then the cotton inset basically looks like that Another thing that really stood out to me first impressions wise is that the actual nappy itself looks like a pocket nappy. I don't know if you guys know, but there are different types of cloth nappies. You get pocket nappies, sleeves, all in ones, you know, different types, which I've talked about in this video that I'm gonna link it up here. So go ahead and check that out in case you're a little bit confused. There's a whole different variety of cloth nappies. In the back, it's got this little elastic thing so that, you know, it can stretch out around baby's waist. And that's the pocket situation I'm talking about right here. This this is where you slide the inset and it looks like a little pocket so you basically stuff the inset into the pocket nappy right here the liners are bamboo and very like thin nothing really to write home about they're just like regular bamboo liners anyway let's get into my actual review on these nappies i really didn't like how it feels how the actual nappy feels the outside especially it doesn't feel very strong it feels like after a few washes it might just rip i don't know i could be wrong i really do hope that i'm wrong but it just doesn't feel very strong it feels like the waterproofing on the actual cover itself will start separating as you wash them and when that happens then it starts ripping and then the nappy starts leaking so i wasn't really impressed by the actual quality feel of the nappy i really expected more i'm not gonna lie because clicks is such a huge brand this right here that goes around the baby's legs it is nice and stretchy so i really like that i really really loved this part here that goes on baby's bum i mean not really because you put a liner but you catch my drift it's very, very soft it feels like a nice warm fleecy jersey that you would wear on a cold rainy day at home while you're watching netflix it is that soft but 
as soon as I washed them, I've washed them twice, the, the softness just sort of like goes away. I guess it happens with every fleecy thing basically, but day one I was like, oh my God, that's gloriously soft, which I absolutely love. I personally am not a big fan at all all of of the insets they're very very tiny in fact i'm gonna stick one into the actual nappy itself they're very very small especially if you're gonna be using this with your baby from like they say newborn up till 36 months it's gonna be a very tight fit but not is 24 months now in <laughs> this inset barely covers her this is the inset it goes here like it's literally here yes it's all the way down here on this side which is what you want but then it goes here and then we have all this extra space up here in the nappy that has got nothing so when you do put this on the baby i found it the leak just it was just so frustrating and then the fact that it's cotton also doesn't help because cotton doesn't absorb much we had to change this i mean granted we only have two nappies and then the third inset so i ended up putting three insets in one nappy and even that we still had to change it like barely two hours later we had to change it because it was soaking so i don't know what was the logic with using cotton bamboo is usually your best bet on microfiber insets when it comes to cloth nappies because they're very very absorbent look if you're going to be using it in the night then i absolutely with zero doubt recommend that you use a hemp inset that will last you all night no doubt about that granola sleeps with one hemp inset and a one bamboo um, inset so bamboo and hemp together and she goes through the night and we only change her nappy around 8 a.m ish in the morning cotton I don't understand the logic i really don't in fact this reminds me of toweling nappies that we grew up using because the material i mean it looks exactly the same look they just sort of like designed and sewed them and cut them up to look like an, a cloth nappy inset but in actual fact this just looks like a toweling nappy i mean what's different from taking our face towels our cotton face towels and stuffing them into this nappy cup and calling it a nappy because it's, it's essentially the same thing they say you can use this from newborn up until 36 months but the problem is with newborn babies their waists are so tiny that i found with my kids the cloth nap you you sort of it goes like that and then when it comes on the other side it overlaps on this one side so basically this is the nappy right you would close it like this and then you snap it into position here snap it into position and then you would bring the other side and you snap it over the already snapped ones because their waists are so tiny the problem with the snappy is it doesn't have that overlapping snapping thing right here so you end up having basically a really big nappy on the baby so i don't know why they forgot that i actually don't even understand how that happened i mean even if you do get a big baby you know your four kgs plus babies maybe you might not need that overlap but it's always a good idea to have that especially if you're planning to use these nappies not just with your one baby but with the baby that comes after that baby you know because not all kids are born the same weight you never really know i actually think the logic says instead of popping it on the first one to fit a newborn you would pop it on the second one you would pop it like that which would make it almost fit a newborn i get that i see how they th they thought that would be the case but then the question is then what do you do with this do you just leave it like that that doesn't look very it doesn't look very cute at all it's just going to be an extra thing sitting on baby's tummy so you can actually resize the nappy this way um to make the around the thighs fit better but it's the resizing around the waist that's a bit of a challenge to be honest also i just noticed it's got these little poppers right here but i'm not sure where they're supposed to go I, I don't understand where they are supposed to go. The bamboo liners are honestly just bamboo liners. You put it on top of a nappy before you put the nappy on the baby so that when baby goes number two and they make a poo, you can just scoop up the liner and dunk that into the toilet without having to like rinse out the nappy. We've went the route of reusable liners, so we reuse those as well. We wash and all of that fun stuff. And honestly, it is not a lot of work. It really isn't. When it comes to price-wise, each one of these boxes was probably around 150 plus don't remember i don't know what happened to my receipt i think it was about 150 
each which works out to be 450 for three boxes is it worth it to be honest i would say not necessarily because these nappies are not going to give you what you need see if you were to buy a regular cloth nappy with a bamboo inside as well as a microfiber inside and you get just two of those nappies i would say yes it's worth it it will get you through the day where's this one because it's a cotton inset it won't even last you two three hours i don't know if the quality would withstand having to be washed every single week without fail i honestly doubt that at this point based off of what i've seen and how they feel the size on this it's also a little bit questionable because it says newborn to 36 months Bonolo is barely 24 months like she is just hitting 25 months now and the nephew could barely fit her like it looked really small on her which was actually very worrying because all of her cloth nappies that she's still wearing now they fit her very well like she could go another year with them honestly at this point i don't recommend buying them i would recommend go to the regular cloth nappy people check them out and see what sort of nappies they sell and compare them for yourself if you have to i'm happy with their bamboo liners i just prefer using reusable ones but their bamboo liners are fantastic but anyway that's that i tried them out i'm not using them anymore at this point anyway let me know your thoughts let me know if you've seen them around what do you think are you excited have you tried them how did it go for you would you buy them would you try them what do you think have you tried cloth nappies let's talk down below but for today that's it a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching share this video with a mom a mom to be a mom's friend a friend of a mom all of that fun stuff and auntie grandma grandparents share with them let them know before they go spend money trying to surprise the mom to be or the mom or anybody who has kids in their lives don't let them waste their money like that let them know before it's too late um until then we'll catch you besties on our next video bye besties